And over time, as they grow their software and services revenue share by driving more recurring revenues, their expenses will continue to go down because they won't have to pay to acquire that recurring revenues because they already have it, already got that customer who is paying them every month, every year, right? Or every two years, whatever the contract is. So over time, their margins go up and their dominance goes up. And the reason it's growing over time and not just staying flat is because they're increasing the recurring revenues. The more revenue that's guaranteed in the future, the less it costs to acquire more revenues. They don't have to go sell someone to get that revenue again because it's already coming back to them over and over and over and over again. That's why SaaS companies get the best valuations. That's why you saw Snowflake get a super high valuation, right? Same thing with Amazon, Amazon Web Services. They make so much money from that. Same thing with Netflix. That's why Netflix crushes their competitors because they already have this huge subscriber base, which means that they don't have to go sell as many people on trying their service, which means in turn that they can dedicate more money to producing better content for their existing customers and to lure in more customers that will pay them on a recurring basis and then continue that cycle. They continue to dominate. <laughs> That's what ChargePoint's gonna do. That's why their margins are growing so fast.